The police today said that they failed to prove its case beyond reasonable doubt over the double homicide of the mother and daughter in Kota Ketana Kahawatta. The police made this announcement at a press conference this evening. The three persons accused on the double homicide of a mother and a daughter in Kota Ketana Kahawatta in 2012 were acquitted by the Colombo High Court yesterday. Tensions broke out as the news reached the locals of Kota Ketana. <laughs> Police used high pressure water cannons to disperse the locals who were behaving in an unruly manner in the Kotaketana town and were only met with locals retaliating by pelting stones. Senior lawyer U R D Silva, appearing for the defence, commented on the manner in which the evidence was presented. So, ko satan kisi vak policey avisin upayogi karagena tiburi nae parikshana kati hoto alta woman avin eva demuanam me. The police had not used any material from reports from the scenes of crime officer or Soko. If those were used for the investigations, the tale that they created would be proven wrong. DNA tests were conducted. The DNA tests have revealed that none of the three accused are the rapists. This is an important matter. The medical officer who conducted the tests had compared with other sperm samples. That was a decisive factor in this case. They concealed this information. We obtained the DNA reports and brought it in the medical officer in question through the defense. This needs to be done by the complainant. This raises questions over the investigations of the police. Why did not the police produce a report of Vaskunavodhana? Why wasn't the DNA report produced? The police convened a media briefing to comment on the Kotakathana homicide case. There is no debate on this. The accused have been acquitted. This is because the evidence was not sufficient for the investigation. The complainants had failed to prove this in court beyond reasonable doubt. The police are witnesses in this case. Four DNA samples are being compared with those of one person. We have no information of this person. Views was expressed on the responses made by the people of Kotakathana over the case. An appeal can be made. That needs to be decided by the Attorney General. The AG need to be convinced that facts can be proven in the appeal. Two police officers injured during the tense standoff yesterday continue to receive treatment at the Kavata Hospital. The police are yet to make any arrests of the incident. The Ambilipitiya Ratnapura Main Road, which was closed since last evening, was reopened this morning.